the other part of the positions that's handy to notice is that if you let's do our A minor pentatonic and we got to our root right if we then put our pointy finger there just like we had it on our root here we'll put our pointy finger on that root and we're actually doing the same thing we have to move up because of the B string that the way the B string is tuned uh, differently than the rest of the strings um, a fourth instead of a fifth uh, that's why we move but you could simply carry whatever you're in let's say we're in G right okay we just keep doing that same for, for pentatonic, um, do the, the spread to the pinky, whoops, then pointy ring, pointy ring, right? So wherever we find a root, we can do that same thing. Slide for the B string, right? We're on a root again. And if we had more strings, we could do it. So, all it, it's just carrying that whole, whole half, whole, whole half thing. Um, and, be, you know, we're working in minor, so it's falling a little bit different. Um, and I'm terrible at remembering the uh, minor intervals. Um, but... Okay. Um you're simply bringing yourself up to the next root um, and, and starting the same pattern when you're into other uh, patterns of the scale. It's, it's not a whole new thing. Um, it's just when you get, like I said, to your root, then, then you're going to... Just carrying on from there. Anyhow, um, don't get lost in it. Remember, it's all just the two things. Uh, major to minor is taking that whole, whole half, whole, whole, whole half, like I said in the last video, and starting where you change, or uh, changing where you start uh, that particular pattern it always stays the same. Um, it's just a difference of where you begin it. Um, and then as far as the patterns on the guitar go, if you can play um, that pattern and be your first octave of the pentatonic in A, then no matter where you find A, oh, we gotta slide up for that B. Wherever you find A, um, come on, brain. I can't, 13, there's 15. Right? And then I could do it again. If I, if I had more frets. So if you can do pointy, pinky, pointy, ring, pointy, ring, to cover a pentatonic pattern, you can do that again no matter where you put your uh, pointy finger as long as it's a root. Um, and the same thing for major, if you put your pinky on the root um, and then you know carry it up from there, you'll be able to run your major anywhere you can find a root.